Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Advanced Trick Theory. Today we're going to be looking at throttle management and subsequently speed and altitude management. So let's get into the video. So a lot of people just want to fly fast like this. And the problem with that is you tend to be up real high, which doesn't give a very good feeling of speed. You get a greater feeling or illusion of speed if you say you're low to the ground. So I'm not going very fast right now, but I'm staying as low as I can to the ground. And it makes it feel like I'm going a lot faster than I actually am. So it's better to go low and slow than fast and high. Another thing that some people do is that they goose the throttle a lot, on and off the throttle, especially going around turns and stuff. And that makes everything a lot less smooth, especially if you have a bad tune. So you want to be smooth in your throttle changes. Not necessarily slow, but just keep it smooth. Another thing is, you want to try to manage your throttle and your altitude so that you can stay as close to objects as you can. Because if you're really far away from objects, it makes it feel like you're going slower. And you can't really see the object as well. So, so if I do a split S over this tree really far away, it doesn't look very interesting just because you can barely see the tree. Whereas if I stay close to it, Everything's moving more, you can see more details, so it makes the footage look better. So you want to stay as close as possible. It also shows off your skill that you can stay close to objects. Another thing is some people will go too fast and then when they come to corner, it's not very smooth. So. If I find a place to do like a, a turnaround, so if I go around this light pole, if I go around these light poles too fast, it's not very smooth if you do it like that. So if you just manage your speed, you can do real nice and slow and smooth turns around all your objects. So a lot of this is really just flying slower than you think you should in order to stay close to objects, stay close to the ground, make your turns really smooth. So yes, you can eventually do everything faster, but not until you're good at doing things slowly. Another thing you can try is using as little throttle to execute moves as possible. Because then you can find you can do moves in a lot tighter spaces. And it actually can make flying a lot more fun because you can hit more gaps and things just because you're going really slow. So if you look at one of my previous videos, I'm flying a six inch around a playground with really small gaps. And that's actually some of the most fun I've had just because I'm going so slow and just working on the precision. So those are just a couple things you can try. So just a recap, you want to fly low, stay close to objects, and be smooth on the throttle. And then just try flying with as little throttle as possible. Okay, so I hope you guys learned something from these tips in this video. If you have any other ideas or things you want to see on advanced trick theory, please put them down in the description below. Like this video if you liked it, and get subscribed if you want to see more content like this in the future. Thanks for watching.